Ulanzi just released a new microphone and it's in my hands. Now this is the A30 wireless microphone. Look, it's the size of my thumb. This microphone packs quite a punch with its 16-bit recording, noise reduction, magnets, as well as other interesting items to customize your setup. Did I also mention that they come with wind muffs too? So, if you're looking for a microphone that can fit both mobile and cameras, this might be worth considering. Now, let's talk about its unique features. Above it being just very small, it's also extremely customizable. Now, in case you do not like this black, they actually provide you with a white shell. So you can actually remove it. You can actually remove the front cover and replace it with the white. This looks so much better if you're actually wearing a brighter colour shirt compared with the one that is black. Now, they also come with a few other interesting stickers. This. These are a list of different stickers that you can actually paste on it to be able to help you to not just to indicate but to make it sort of cuter. So let's say in the case which I have two different microphones and it's hard to tell them apart, I can just simply take one of the smiley faces. Okay, let's try this smiley face over here. Okay, and paste it over here. Ta-da! Now, if you're wondering how does this receiver is able to adapt to different devices. So this is obviously a USB-C. It actually also comes with a lightning adapter. So if you're actually using the older mobile phones from, if you're actually using the older iPhones or iPads, you can just simply put it on top and convert the port. You should be able to see at the sides, there is the USB-C and this uh, 3.5 millimeter jack. And they also come with wires that you are able to plug into a USB-C to be able to convert to different devices such as your cameras. Now, all of this also comes with a very neat pouch. Very useful to be able to put all your little trinkets in. Oh, why is that? Why is there a grass over here? Either way, here's a quick 30 seconds unboxing video of what the whole package comes with. So this is what it comes with in its retail package. Now, of course, the most important question is actually, how does it sound? What is the quality like? Let's test them out. Here's the audio that's coming up from my mobile phone and let's now attach the microphone. Okay, so let's just plug it in. Okay, I think I need to take out my casing. Yeah, and it's obviously getting sunny. I'll be sweating quite a bit. So we should be plugged in, yes. So let's attach this microphone with the magnets. Oh, where's the magnets? Ta-da, the magnet. Keep it right beside my usual magnet. This is the audio test of the microphone. All right, so we're actually out in the open. Oh, right, something just came up. Uh, this microphone also has its own noise reduction. So you also notice that it actually is better than the average microphone's quality. So this is the audio that's coming out from the A30 wireless microphone. Now, one thing that I also forgot to mention that the microphone also records in 18-bit. Now, 18-bit is actually more than the average. Usually, it records only up to about 12-bit for normal microphones. Of course, the higher tier ones can record up to 32-bit, such as the DJI Mic 2. But we are all talking about a $50 microphone with this capability, which I think is something special about it. Alright, so let's now do another quick audio test. So this is the audio coming out from my Sony ZV-E1. And let's use the microphone that is on my camera. Alright, so here's the audio that's coming out from my uh, Samsung Z Flip 5 internal microphone. And let's plug the A30 in. So here's the audio that's coming out from my A30 without the wind muff. Now let's give one last try and plug in with the wind muff. 
So here is the audio that is with the wind muff attached. Okay, you can see that it's very windy. My hair is actually blowing over here. So this is the audio with the wind muffs. The wind muff is certainly really useful to be able to cancel out a lot of the noise. Just now, if you guys heard, there are actually a lot of rustling and my, my voice sounds really pain because of that extra noise that is introduced. So yes, this is the quality of the A30. How do you guys feel about the audio quality coming up from this microphone? Right, so here's the audio that's coming out from my uh, Samsung Z Flip 5. So this is the audio with the wind muffs. The wind muff is certainly really useful to be able to cancel out a lot of the noise. Now, let's get nerdy and talk about some specifications. The casing itself comes in at about 95mm or 3.7 inches. As for its height, it comes in at 51mm or exactly 2 inches. As for its weight, with all the microphones inside, it comes in at only 88 grams or 0.2 pounds, which is basically negligible, meaning super light. As for their battery capacity, each one of these has a battery capacity about 100 mAh. Interestingly, including the charging case itself, all of them have 100 mAh. Each of these lasts about 1.5 hours. The casing itself will give an extra charge of about 3 hours. So you're looking at a total of 4.5 hours. Now, you might be thinking that's not covering the whole hours of the day, but most of the time, I'm actually doing interval shooting, meaning I only record in batches and not one whole long shot. So four hours is actually more than enough. Now, but if you're interested in the size of one of these, it actually comes in at 32 mm or 1.2 inches. Basically, super small once again, look. Let's now talk about its price. The microphone, along with its casing and all its little trinkets, comes in at only 50 USD. It has an option of either white or black. Now you might be thinking, 50 bucks isn't that cheap. I agree, but you're getting a lot more than the usual microphones. Most microphones do not come with the wind muffs nor the magnet. And needless to say, not all transmitters can adapt to camera devices. So in my books, I think it's perfectly reasonable. Let's conclude. What do I think about the A30 wireless microphone? Should you get it? If you don't already own the microphone, I think the A30 can offer you a lot. Above giving you decent sound, it comes with a magnet which allows you to clip onto the center of your top, which is the ultimate location for recording good vocals. It also comes with a wind muff which is extremely useful in recording in windy environments. Such as this, essential for all those who regularly film outdoors. For the price and things you are getting, this certainly is a good start to get you into the audio game. So, what do you guys think? Is this microphone something that you will consider? Or are there better options out there? I'm curious. Let me know down in the comments below. Besides this, Ulanzi also sent me their new MA30 Carabiner tripod for mobile phones. So, you might want to stick around. If not, see you guys in the next video.